Segi ini dilengkapi perangkat penunjang dan pencahayaan yang memadahi, maka sangat kapabel sebagai bengkel kerja dan pembimbingan penciptaan karya seni lukis. 2. Studio Patung Bangunan Studio Patung terpisah dari gedung induk dengan luas 48 meter persegi, dilengkapi dengan perangkat mekanik terbaru dan perangkat keamanan kerja yang terkontrol. 3. Studio Keramik Studio Keramik memiliki dua bagian bangunan. Bangunan seluas 24 meter persegi untuk proses perancangan karya, dan 40 meter persegi untuk proses pembakaran karya. Di dalamnya, terdapat dua tungku pembakaran berbahan bakar LPG dan listrik yang keseluruhannya berkuota 1,5 kubik. 4. Studio Grafis Studio Grafis sangat representatif untuk proses pembimbingan dan penciptaan karya. Berbagai perangkat untuk proses berkarya dari semua teknik penciptaan seni grafis berskala internasional telah tersedia dalam kondisi terawat dan terkontrol dengan baik meliputi mesin lino, stensil, cetak, alat pengering, dan sebagainya. 5. Laboratorium Multimedia sebagai strategi akselerasi perkembangan teknologi informasi dan multimedia, Prodi juga memiliki laboratorium multimedia berstandar internasional. 6. Ruang kelas Dalam proses pembelajaran berbasis teoretikal, Prodi memiliki ruang-ruang kelas berstandar internasional yang dilengkapi dengan fasilitas pendingin ruangan, jaringan internet, serta perangkat presentasi berbasis multimedia. Keseluruhannya dalam kondisi terawat dan terkontrol dengan baik. 7. Selain itu, sebagai bentuk kepedulian pada penyandang disabilitas, Fakultas Seni Rupa dan Desain juga membangun akses khusus seperti akses jalan untuk kursi roda hingga dengan kamar mandi yang ramah disabilitas. Prodi Seni Rupa Murni merupakan salah satu prodi Well, ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention? Well, ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? Our virtual exhibition is about to begin. We will remind you to mute your microphone during this event, except for the speakers. Thank you. Thank you very much for preparing yourself to join our virtual exhibition. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh, Honorable Dean of Art and Design Faculty Universitas Blas Maret, Dr. Rahman Widet, MSN, and all of Honorable Vice Dean Art and Design Faculty Universitas Blas Maret, Honorable Curator Team of Second International Visual Art Exhibition Multiframe, Professor Dr. Siawan Sabana MFA from Art and Design Faculty Institute Teknologi Bandung, Indonesia, Dr. Samsul Muhammad from Design Department School of the Arts, University of Science, Malaysia, and the one and only the curator in this team, Mrs. Helena Skova from Czech Republic, Honorable Lecturers of Art and Design Faculty Universitas Blas Maret, respectable all the participants, and of course, all invited guests of this virtual exhibition. Let thanks to God, the Almighty, who has given us his mercies and blessings so that we can attend this virtual exhibition without any troubles and obstacles. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Desino Chahyanti. It's a precious chance for me to be your master of ceremony in this afternoon on Monday, 23rd November, 2020, in our big event, Second International Visual Art Exhibition Multiframe, bringing diversity into harmony and virtual world. This virtual exhibition is conducted by Fun Art Department and counseling supported by Art and Design Faculty Universitas Blas Maret. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, before we start our agenda for today, we will sing Indonesia's national anthem, Indonesia Raya.
Okay, before we go to the next agenda, please, you can show your video because we will take your picture for documentation and put in the catalog. We will account for several time. Please be patient. That will help by Mrs. Novia as the photographer. Go on, Mrs. Novia. Please. Hey, Ms. Desi. Okay, start from slide one. Okay. Go on. Okay. Okay. This is enough, Mrs. Sylvia. This is enough, Mrs. Sylvia. Yeah, it's enough. Thank you, Miss Daisy. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much, Mrs. Sylvia, for helping us take the picture for documentation. Okay. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, step on the following agenda are speeches. The first is the coming speech from Dr. Ahmad Wiedey at MSN as the Dean of Art and Design Faculty at Universitas Bas Marat. And afterward, we would like to kindly ask Dr. Ahmad to officially open the second international visual art exhibition, Multiframe. We invite Dr. Ahmad for delivering the speech and opening this event. Dr. Ahmad, please, time is yours. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. First of all, let us express our gratitude to Allah Subhanahu wa Ta'ala, the God Almighty, for His mercy and blessing, so that the second international visual art exhibition, multi frame number two, with the topic of bringing diversity into harmony in virtual world that will be heard on November 23rd to December 23rd, 2020 can be run successfully through the tunda ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. The Fine Arts Study Program had this exhibition virtually. It is an extraordinary effort made by the Fine Arts Study Program to always present an international level exhibition. FD card once said, I think therefore I am, the Fine Arts Study Program can say, I exhibit therefore I am. Multiframe number two is supported by 160 artists from 16 countries and it's very appealing to watch, discuss, appreciate, and criticize because it presents the individual achievement of the fine artists participating in the exhibition as a response to the current situation and condition. Such response are interpreted and expressed to the visual media. The significance of this exhibition is that it is closer to the viewers and easier to access because it is had virtually. I would like to congratulate and thank the 20 international artists from Armenia Canada, India, Japan, Korea, Lebanon, Malaysia, Mauritius, Mexico, Myanmar, Netherlands, France, Philippines, Poland, and Singapore, as well as to the 140 Indonesian artists participate in this event. I would also like to express my gratitude and highest appreciation to Professor Dr. Stiawan Sabana, MFA from Institut Teknologi Bandung, Dr. Samsu Muhammad from University Saint Malaysia, and Helena Huskova from the CISA Republic as the curatorial team. My highest appreciation also goes to the Head of Fine Arts Study Program, 
lecturers, student, organizing committee, and all party involved in multi-frame number two event. Finally, I wish you a great exhibition and hope you find meaning and joy from the artwork being presented. Amin Ya Robbal Alamin. On the behalf of the organizing committee and with a prayer to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, on November 23rd, 2020, I announce that the multi-frame number two is officially opened. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you, Dr. Ramani, for the special speech and opening our virtual exhibition. At this time, an official beginning for the virtual exhibition that will run until Wednesday, 23rd December 2020. Please don't forget to fill with quick the present form or guest book that write in the chat room below. Thank you. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, now this is the high time for us to listen to the graduate speech from Dr. Samson Mohammed and we'll continue by Professor Dr. Stialan Staban MFA. Without any further ado, we would like to welcome Dr. Samsu and Professor Stialan to deliver the speech. Please, time is yours. Assalamualaikum and very good evening to our honorable guests for witnessing the opening ceremony of Multiframe 2. Hi, my name is Shamsu Muhammad from Design Department, School of the Arts, University of Science of Malaysia. It is my great pleasure to be invited as a curator for this special event, virtual exhibition due to the COVID-19 outbreak. Referring to the artwork by young artists, the artwork perceived diversity in terms of the medium and theme of the work. They convey message through various medium and technique such as painting, digital print, photography, batik, collage and mixed media. I would like to congratulate to Dr. Rahmanu Widayat, Dean of Faculty of Arts and Design, 11 Marriott University and the committee on this fantastic event during the COVID-19 pandemic. I hope we could tie more mutual networking between School of the Arts USM and Faculty of Arts and Design 11 Marriott University not only in arts and culture activity but also in research and publication. Terima kasih. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Salam sejahtera buat kita semua um, First of all, I would like to thank the committee of the event for having invited me to be one of the uh, curators in this uh, forum entitled Multi Frame the Second I have actually uh, curated a number of uh, works uh, quite plenty, but uh, for this occasion, I would just like to show you a little number of the works because of the limited timing for me to be uh, standing here. Let me start with uh, the work by Nuning Damayati, 
from ITV Indonesia. The title of the work is uh, Been Making Daring Silaturahmi Number One and Two. Technically, it's a um, mixed media, digital photos, and graphic print making. Second one is uh, by Sigit Adi Purnomo from the Faculty of Art and Design, University of 11 Maret. Uh, title of the work is Positive Thoughts in the Midst of a Pandemic. The next one is a uh, painting by Ipong Purnama Sidi. Um, he's a well-known artist. Uh, the title of the work is The Ballad of Gecko. Size uh, 160 centimeters time 1 to 9 centimeters. Medium is acrylic on canvas. Next one is a work by Abu Jala Simon from Singapore. The title is The Core and the Mind. Together, the burden is lighter. Size uh, 170 centimeters time 130 centimeters. The medium is acrylic on campus, year 2020. Then the, the work from uh, an artist from Mexico, Rodolfo Dias Just Jose, title is Spining Wheels, size uh, mixed techniques, uh, 100 centimeters time 235 centimeters and uh, 50 centimeters. It's, it's a sculpture done in 2020. And then the painting by Said Anif Osani from Mauritius entitled Sega Dance Series. Together the burden is lighter. Size uh, 120 centimeters times uh, 90 centimeters. Medium is acrylic and collage on canvas. This is a, a painting by Yayan Suharlan from the Faculty of Art and Design, University of 11 Maret. Um, this is a, clearly a face of a lion. Then uh, next is Connie uh, Herawati. What is interesting, uh, she's not from the art department, but she's from the product design uh, department. The title of the work is Looking for the Way Out. Size uh, 50 centimeters, time uh, 50 centimeters. Medium acrylic on campus. Year of execution is 2020. Next one is a painting by Professor Sudarsono from Solo uh, Institute of the Arts, Indonesia, titled Above the Horizon. Then uh, a painting by Luna Dian Setia, entitled Badra Kali Kapalini, Mixed Media, uh, year 2020. Then a painting by Romantika Gema Merdeka entitled Belenggu Kepasrahan, medium acrylic on canvas. This is a work by Hartini Laswandi entitled Learning Chair Design for Actively in Inclusive Schools Research and Development, size chair design 1, 2, chairs uh, 4D. Mediums uh, mixed media year 2020. Then Octavianus France title Beda Pikir Side A and Side B different thing size uh, A to paper medium pencil paper drawing year 2020. Next one is a work by Mickey Endo Santoso entitled The Sour of Kadawun. Uh, uh, medium uh, stainless stainless steel um, year execution 2019. Next one is a painting by Argan Groho. This is a very colorful painting, very very nice to, to observe. Next one is uh, by Riza Giuliardi, titled Drunkenness, um, acrylic on canvas and executed in the in 2019. Next one is uh, 
a painting by Alfa Fadila and titled A Life. Uh, the medium is mixed uh, media, photography, and, and digital, executed in 2020. Then uh, Sari Devi Kunchoro Putri, entitled Diversity of Digital Art, executed in uh, 2020. Next one is a painting by Sarah Ayu Kunchoro Putri, titled I Love Diversity. The medium is digital art. Year of execution is uh, nine, uh, 2020. Next one is uh, a work by Sofia Himato Alia, uh, titled Kedok. Uh, medium is uh, mixed media, uh, as a good in 2020. Then Isma Awa Fitro Cahyani, entitled Tumpuk. Medium is uh, pencil and paper. Uh, executed in uh, 2019. Then uh, a black white painting Andi, by Andini Futi entitled uh, Crack. Uh, medium is pencil and paper uh, executed in 2019. Then uh, a black white uh, work by Hausan Adam Sabian entitled My Fear of Darkness Drawing. Um, is, is executed in uh, 2018. Next one, um, another black and white uh, work of art by Ainun Nur Badila, entitled Tuaku Mudamu. Medium is pencil on, on paper. Um, here is uh, another work by Devi Isma Ariani, interesting composition, entitled Love No Snow Mountains. This is uh, a work by Muhammad Saifuddin, entitled Garuda Nagi Janji. Next one is uh, a work by Gabriele Maria Anna, entitled Berdampingan. Next one is uh, Uad Safrudin, um, entitled Blind Hero vs. Monsters uh, Corona. Next one by Agung Eko Yurianti, entitled Kalau kita tidak merawatnya, ma uh, mau jadi apa? Then uh, a work by Ben Hendro, uh, entitled Face. Then a work uh, by Susanto, Pembelaan Tak Terbatas. Then by Farha Adibah, entitled We Have the Same uh, Shadow. Then next one is by Aulia Wara Arimbi Putri, uh, entitled uh, Jejak. Then the next one is by Aisha Konita, entitled Happy Quarantine. Next one is by Ari Satrio Wibowo, entitled Menutup Diri. Next one by Emut Pratiwi, entitled Menembus Batas. Then the last but not least, by Rina Mariana, entitled Beautiful and Fresh During Pandemic. Okay, that was... Uh, works that I have uh, curated. As I told you, it's not the whole one, but only a little number of it. I have an impression, a very good impression, that uh, the, the works in the exhibition has shown us uh, a very multi uh, frames of artworks uh, that are shown in the exhibition. Hope you enjoyed the presentation. Thank you very much for attention. Thank you, Dr. Thompson, for her social for the informative virtual speech, which certainly make us know another perspective about the art and resistances in a special situation. For the information, both Dr. Samsu and Professor Stelan's speech also cover Mrs. Helena's directorial speech. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, now we happily enter our main agenda, the second multi-frame artist statement, and we will continue with second multi-frame gallery tour. Ladies and gentlemen, please be back, sit up and relax. Let's watch the videos together.
my studio and I'd like to send my greetings to my friends in Asia, especially in Indonesia. Thank you for inviting me to this exhibition, this virtual exhibition. I work uh, in uh, ceramic painting and printmaking. Examples of my work that are up in the studio. So, thank you again for inviting me, and I hope you enjoy this uh, virtual exhibition. I've enjoyed participating in very much. Thanks. Hi. Okay. Let me first introduce myself. My name is Jasmine Binti Mama Omar, and you could say I am a budding artist, an emerging artist who's based in, in Georgetown, Penang, Malaysia. Okay, just a little bit about me. I majored in ceramics in both my diploma and degree during university. I, I, no, I studied in UITM or University Technology Mara in Sri Skandar Perak and also in Shah Alam Selangor. And right now I'm currently working as both a porter ceramic artist and also a barista in my own cafe that's in Georgetown, Penang, Malaysia called Potter's Base Cafe. It's, well, it's basically a cafe and also a mini studio for myself. When, okay, going into about how COVID-19 impacted me and maybe a bit about how it impacted Georgetown in general. Georgetown is basically a city that mainly targets tourists from other countries. So even before Malaysia closed its borders, we could already see a decrease in tourists in town. To some extent, even during weekends, the town was so empty, it was almost like a ghost town in contrast to pre-COVID. A lot of businesses have closed down because they have lost their customers, basically. Even domestic customers like look domestic tourists or people who live in Malaysia are not enough to compensate the loss of tourists in Georgetown. I'm Akili Kian from Beirut, Lebanon and I'm very happy to be part of this very interesting exhibition Multi-Frame Number 2. Uh, and I would like to thank the curators uh, and especially my friend Donna uh, Prawita. Uh, the th for, uh, for the theme of this exhibition that it is bringing uh, diversity into unity uh, through virtual art of course because we are in lockdown now uh, is very interesting because we are having the whole world under lockdown and the diversified uh, talents uh, are, are all ex Hello, have a nice day. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Montez Adil from Nanyama. Thank you so much for the invitation to me in this exhibition. Best wish to all of you. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Tanis Kichi from Ceramita Studio. Ceramita Studio is one of the studio located in Bali Pulau, in Indonesia. I am a full-time fine art artist who work on conventional and non-conventional uh, medium. Especially I use clay as my main medium to create artwork. Before, I would like to thank each and every person who work behind this virtual exhibition. Thank you to Ibu Dana and also to respectful judges who selected my artworks to be a part of uh, Multi-Frame International Art Exhibition. Unforgettable memory is an artwork inspired from Klantanese shadow puppets, Wayang Kulik Klantan. It has different chronology in terms of style, story, and design. 
that origin from different places while discuss about the beauty of this heritage technology and development plays a important role in changes of this tradition in this contemporary era development of the internet and social media apps make people easy to access something indirectly they forget about the art of the shadow puppet and this tradition that almost instinct corresponding to that this work combined with technology and tradition form as a controversial approach between both of it also to create awareness to our local communities rebuild our heritage lives Let's talk about working during this covid-19 pandemic uh, yeah i have faced so many obstacles like financial pro promotion marketing and also production but here i just want to tell only one thing uh, this covid-19 pandemic or lockdown did not stop me as an artist to create artworks. Before I conclude my statement, I would like to say thank you to each and every person who uh, helped me directly and indirect, indirectly during uh, produce this artwork. And also congratulations to each and every person that selected for this multi frame international art exhibition. And thank you. I will attach my email and also my Instagram. Please do write your comment or I am Florence Cinco from Tinambakan District, Talbayog City, Samar, Philippines. A mixed media artist and sculptor. A fine arts graduate at the University of San Carlos, Cebu City. My art practice is a spiritual meditation. I meditate twice a day until I realize God and awareness to conserve the environment, health, roots culture, social issues, political issues, and service to humanity. Now, the issues is about COVID-19. My opinion is social distancing. Without the COVID-19 situation, could have been drawback, considering that most open. Our self-expression entails basic touching. Thank you very much and God bless. Hello, I'm Hilda Kelekian from Beirut, Lebanon. I'm uh, I, I'm an art student. I've graduated in 85 in interior architecture and fine arts. For me, painting is like breathing. It's the oxygen that I, I, I have. I have. I'm specialized in parchment painting and uh, miniatures. On the other hand, I do abstract art where I express myself in colors. The only advantage that I found in the COVID-19 is to make me sit more in my studio and paint and express myself. I wish good health to everybody and hope you have a nice day. Thank you. Hi everyone. Hi. My name is Abu Jalal uh, Sarimon. I'm from Singapore. Uh, I'm currently in my studio. Uh, today is Saturday whereby people, family enjoy their weekend together, usually at home. Uh, Singapore are very cautious about the whole thing. And uh, as an artist, uh, I enjoy my time in my studio, which is uh, usually this, this place is quite uh, busy and a bit noisy, but because of COVID, I enjoy the very quiet time and I enjoy producing my work uh, at, this, at this moment. I would like to share you, with you my painting that I've just completed uh, for COVID. Uh, you can see here. A painting of two guys uh, walking. One is uh, with the dark face, another one with the colored face. Uh, the title is Marching On. It's a very uh, interesting painting that uh, I want to share with people whereby uh, the dark face figure depicting uh, 
the struggling that we have today. We struggle towards COVID. We struggle towards the climate change. And we have to really change and face the situation. For we want to be stronger. We want to be more confident. We want to be more healthy in the future. So everyone, do stay safe. Enjoy your time while you can. Enjoy your time with your family, with the loved ones. Because the time under COVID allow us to be with them, allow us to be close to them. That's what I've been doing. You know, I've been enjoying my time with my family, my wife, my children, my two grandson, and uh, some young artists, you know, who come to my studio, who want to learn paintings. So, thank you very much. Stay safe. Uh, hope to see you guys uh, in the exhibitions. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hello everyone, my name is Ipong Kornamazidi. I am an artist from Indonesia and my hometown is Jakarta City, the capital of Indonesia. My activities in many fields of art, from painting, printmaking, drawing, illustration, ceramic, book design, and as curator in this uh, pandemic uh, period is very difficult for an artist not only artists in my country but also all of the world because uh, many many uh, exhibition was uh, delayed and almost all gallery Almost all galleries is uh, closed and it makes a uh, difficult to distribution of artwork from uh, an artist. But uh, this pandemic period is a uh, benefit for me because I have a lot of time to create a new work uh, and also ready to uh, offline exhibition or online platform exhibition in the next thank you very much for the international organization kapan edan yang rang edan raket duman ada penyakit kang aran corona ayo podong hati-hati ojo deng You want no man and Kushala Yen Iki Kape on a man for a take and go Kessa in Bangan Rohani Karu Chasmani Ocho Poto Chitro Ole Monkonoiku Ayo Poto 
nyenyuwun maring Gusti. Ben diparingi amrih aman lan sentoso. Saya dari Universitas Kristen Maranatha. Terima kasih untuk undangannya dan selamat dan sukses untuk penyelenggaraan pameran Multiframe Hashtag 2. Work from home membuat energi untuk berkarya meledak berkali-kali. Boom, boom. Selamat dan sukses untuk penyelenggaraan Multiframe Hashtag 2. Hello, my name is Jenny Lee. I'm from Surabaya, Indonesia. It is a pleasure for me to join in this exhibition. In eight months in the COVID-19 pandemic, I tried to be consistent to produce my artwork. I'm a ceramics and sometimes I make painting to express my idea. I make several artworks during COVID-19 pandemic and one of them can be enjoyed in this exhibition. I think we have to be optimistic and work harder during the COVID-19 pandemic and spread our passion and spirit for others. Finally, keep healthy and work consistently in art. Thank you. Hello, I'm Connie Hirawati Tuhame Connie. I'm an artist from Jakarta, Indonesia. Now I'm a staff of lecturer in Protect Design in Christian University of Kitawacana in Jakarta. Uh, at first, congratulations for Yes Natalis of UNS and Multiframe Number 2 Art Exhibitions. And thank you for inviting me to join and to participate in this exhibition. This is my artwork. Selamat berkarya di masa sekarang ini. Salam.
I will continue by playing the virtual gallery in this exhibition. This way one gallery, virtual gallery. Okay, Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, together we have watched and enjoyed the video showing the second multi-frame gallery tour virtually. It's being asked to explore all of the exceptional participants with their awesome artwork. Please give applause for such amazing artwork for all the participants. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we now almost close to the ending of this event. Before that, we would like to invite Dr. Stia Budi NSN as the head of Fine Art Department of Art and Design Faculty, Universitas Blackmart, to deliver the closing speech. Please welcome Dr. Stia Budi. Time is yours. Thank you, Ms. Desi, Master of Ceremony. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good afternoon for Indonesia and maybe good evening for other countries. Greeting to all to all of us. Hi, I'm Stio Budi, uh, the head office of the Fine Art Program in Faculty of Art and Design. Also as uh, chairman of the committee in this multi fan exhibition. And I, I'm really proud that this opening ceremony of second multi film virtual exhibition can go well. Therefore, allow me to say thank you so much. Thank you a lot. Especially first, thank to Professor Dr. Jamal Miwakmo as the Chancellor of Universitas 11 Maret Surakarta, Indonesia. And second, Thank to Dr. Rahman Widayat as Dean of Faculty of Art and Design, Universitas Maret, Universitas 11 Maret, Surakarta. And then our gratitude also goes to curator team, ah, Professor Dr. Setiawan Sabana, 
from Institute Teknologi Bandung Indonesia. Then Dr. Samsu Muhammad from University Sain Malaysia. And then last for curator, Miss Helena Hoskova from Czech Republic. Uh, furthermore, also thank to uh, 20 artists from 15 countries. Uh, um, Malaysia, Singapore, Philippines, Myanmar, uh, India, Korea, Japan, Lebanon, Mauritius, Mexico, Netherlands. Uh, uh, French, Poland, Armenia, and Canada. Also thank to 151 artists from Indonesia. It's great, amazing. Thank you also to the community of this exhibition and all those who support it. Second motive frame is a continuation of the first multi exhibition, which was implemented in the 2017. That means uh, three years ago. We hope, we hope that it will be implemented again in this upcoming years. Therefore, of all the artists in profit in this event, I hope will be joining in the next year. At last, by thanking to the cut, Alhamdulillah, the opening ceremony of second multi-frame virtual exhibition was ended. Thank you so much. Happy exhibiting until December 23rd. 2020. Thank you. Salam. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you, Dr. Stabudi, for signs for closing speech. And it has become a remarkable closing for this event. Ladies and gentlemen, before I close this virtual exhibition, we would like to express our gratitude to the curator team, Professor Dr. Silan Sabana, Dr. Samson Mohammed and Mrs. Helena Oskova for the excellent and interesting curatorial speech. And all participants and invited guests for the kind attention and the passion to join the opening ceremony. Hopefully this event will be beneficial for everybody and all of us. Amen. Please give applause for all of us. Thank you. I'm Desi Dachayanti as the master of ceremony. I beg your pardon for the mistake which we may probably have made. Hopefully we can physically meet in the best time soon after pandemic. Stay healthy and safe everybody. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you and good afternoon. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mbak Desi. Thank you, Mbak Desi Chanti. <laughs> Terima kasih, Mbak Ana. Terima kasih. Thank you. Terima kasih, Awan. Terima kasih, Dr. Samsu. Thank you, Mbak Desi. Thank you. 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 Terima kasih. Terima kasih, Dr. Samsung. Terima kasih. 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 Terima kasih.
Foto bersama dong. Foto bersama dong. Fotonya on cam. Saya screenshot. Fotonya. Ayo foto bersama, ayo. Foto lagi yang masih stay. Ayo. Foto lagi nggak apa-apa loh, mumpung masih stay. Oke. Okay. Untuk yang masih stay bisa foto bersama. Kita siapkan tahun depan ya. <laughs> <laughs> Terima kasih, Mbak. Terima kasih. Terima kasih semuanya. Alhamdulillah berjalan lancar semuanya. Terima kasih. Ya, yang saya khawatir listrik. <laughs> Halo Pak, selamat yang pameran di Jogja. Oke, selamat Pak. Congratulations. Thank you, Miss. Thank you very much. Miss Goni Herawati. Nice to see you. Selalu. Jadi foto. Ya, nanti ada katalog Ibu yang akan oh, di-share ya. ke Iya, iya. Siap, Ibu. Terima kasih. Terima kasih Ibu Kani Arawati. Cukup Mbak Desi? Cukup Terima saya, kasih Pak. kepada teman-teman yang semuanya yang masih. Ya. Thank you everybody. Thank you very much. Sudah kok dari tadi sampai fine. Masih tiga lapan. Prof Dwi Marianto masih stay. Aduh. 